Have you ever wondered what it's like to live in a tiny house? Stop. This is a tiny house. Compared to all other houses, this house is definitely small. I am going to see if this tiny house right here is better than the normal house most of us live in. Usually a house have a bedroom, kitchen, bathroom, and all this other stuff if you have a bigger one. But this house can literally fit on someone's backyard. And while I'm here, I'm going to make use of all the stuff that this house can offer. Don't judge me, I can't afford drones. I drove almost two hours just to get to this place, and when I get there, it was worth it. Yo, this place is actually really cool. Literally, it's a tiny house! I was amazed when I got inside, because by the looks from the outside, it doesn't seem like it will have a lot of things, and it's really cute. I never been so amazed in my entire life like this. But before we do anything, house to- You can't blame me, I had a really long drive. There's a couch, TV. There's a sink. And there's water. I'm having fun. There's also the fridge. I call this the kitchen for sure. Here's the bathroom. There's literally so much space in here. Even though it's a tiny house, you can pretty much have anything you want. There's the bed. Ooh, you can slide the stair off. Oh, okay. So you have to put the stairs in here and this hook. I want to actually see the bed first because. I'm going to be sleeping in here. Oh, it is spacious, man. There's so much space in the bed. We just did a quick tour. Now I'm going to start making use of what this tiny house have, starting with... That's enough workout for today. I'm literally just watching Netflix at the moment. Living room check. I have this whole house for myself and I can do anything I want. Call me for the first time yesterday. Now I'm speechless over the edge of this Oh, whoa. <laughs> I gotta stop moving because the whole house is pretty much just shaking. I decided to go outside and get some fresh air. And there's an old truck. It really looks cool. I feel like I'm really far away from the city. Well, the only thing around this house is this open field in the forest. And there's also a place to make fire. So I start preparing it so it will be ready for tonight. Look at the sunset. The sun is starting to go down. It is really beautiful in here. I actually live in the city, so I don't really get this kind of view all the time. Just having this open field and you see the sunset going down, it's pretty amazing. If I'm gonna live in a tiny house, I would choose a place like this where you can see the sunset all the time. There's no one around in here. It's just me. I am going to start preparing for dinner. I am so dumb. I have this chicken breast that was breaded. You know what happened? I ended up putting them on the freezer. Now it's frozen. That is why you don't try to make a video while you're cooking. This house have kitchen? Yep. Dinner is served. This place has a dining room. I mean, I, I wouldn't call it a room, but it's a dining place. This is probably one of the best things to do after you eat dinner. Sit down by the fire and just relax. I feel like I'm one with the nature at the moment because I can hear all the crickets, the bugs, the wind, trees, leaves, everything. I don't know what I'm going to call this spot right here. Not a lot of houses has the place to build a fire. I'm just gonna hang out in here for a while, for sure. You're afraid. Said people get too comfortable Need a change mm -hmm. Said there's something else you're looking for It's okay If 
you're bored to death with your hair, you can cut it. Maybe feel something new. Change what you want when you want, if you want it. Still feel the same about you. Sure, there's a chance that one day you'll regret it, and that day might feel like the end. Your hair will grow back, honey, don't you forget it I love you now till when it's long again mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I am gonna go inside now because I'm hearing noises that I haven't heard before and it's really dark outside so I'm gonna go in now like now holy shit <laughs> I'm actually been hearing noise when I was sitting outside I forgot to kill the fire I really don't want to go outside but I have to go outside to kill that fire or else something bad might happen. Shower. So this tiny house does actually have a shower. I'm gonna test it out. Holy, that, that is cold. really cold. That is cold. That was the coldest shower that I took. I didn't figure out the hot water until like the last minute. Then I spent the rest of my night just watching this educational show. So I'm pretty much by myself in this tiny house. So no one will judge me. So I can do whatever I want, right? And I can wear whatever I want. I just want to say that I haven't sleep yet. It's it's just a little bit past midnight I'll see you guys in the morning. I'm gonna try to get some sleep Good morning, I started my day by making a hot green tea It was an awesome night. I had a really good sleep. I was comfortable. I've been wanting to do something like this. You wake up, you make a fire. It makes you really warm the natural way. Then I made some breakfast. Then I started to clean up. I don't want to leave this house with all my mess. It doesn't really matter what kind of house you live in. If we're talking about house, house can be anything. But if we're talking about home, home is where your family is. Home is where you can be comfortable and be yourself and be with someone that you love. If you have a big house and you can even call it a home, it doesn't really matter how big as your house is. So now is the time we say goodbye to this tiny house. Goodbye couch. Bye bed. Bye living room. My fridge. Bye kitchen. Bye shower. In the end, it doesn't really matter what kind of house you live in, big or small. Size doesn't matter, right? A slime can go live inside. <laughs> and I'm talking about house. I really love my stay in this house. Even though it's just for one night, I was able to make memories in each and every corner of this house. Forgot my wallet. <laughs>